And welcome back fellas. Sure enough, as soon as I turned off the recording, it went without a hitch. So we now have ourselves a main gate key to FEMA and the US Naval Shipyards. And I'm going to quickly read this. Um, this shows basically how easily the media can portray stuff, you know. So, as you can see, we've now had the blame for the whole Liberty Island thing put on us, and we've been using it as, as an excuse for martial law. Um, <laughs> right, and they've basically created a ginormous bogeyman out of J.C. Denton. So, although he's correct that we were involved with Versa Life, <laughs> Organized systematic campaign of terror. You know, it, I, that's one of the things I just love about this game is how, you know, how it just shows you how casually and simply yet profoundly um, the narrative gets twisted by the media here. They're also seeking information on the whereabouts of Alex Jacobson. Yeah, so it looks like he's been taken out as well, or they're trying to anyway. But he should be fairly safe with Tong, so... Yeah, time to start the infiltration. And no, 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 back away from me. I do not want to get into another conversation with you. I've crashed enough times already today. Come on. Go back inside. Go back... No, I do not want to get into a conversation with you guys. Right, quickly. Please. super speed now these things all have stuff in them no I don't this thing says door strength 25 this is why I like the sword I know it doesn't sound like it but the game registers that it's completely silent so and it also lights dark areas, which saves you on battery power. So. And leg speed also means you don't have to go searching around for... Mm. That's ammo if you want it, but we basically ammoed out on everything. sinks on his personal dog's body. Any cameras? No, good. So can we get in here with a bit of Yes, we can. And boy, are we running low on juice. Now, it's tempting just to fill right up on those, but... It's always a question of balance. Do you want to... Weapon storage closet. That's handy. And a reload mod. From Simons to Paul Jenkins. During my review of security measures this morning, I noticed a potential hole in the security office. Please change the code immediately to 2249. I love this. Walton Simons, right? He's, he's walking around and he's basically busting everyone's ass about security and then leaves passcodes on his desk. Right. 
It would be ludicrous, except I've read people, I've not, <laughs> I've seen people in real life with that exact kind of blaseness about things that they're always coming down and everyone else about. Um, reload always goes on the shotgun. Mm. So we can try and hack that terminal, but firstly, let's turn the office lights on. Certificate in something. New Jersey Naval Shipyard. Oh, that's nice. The high definition texture packs increase those significantly. Hmm, that's a 50% lock. No, not even with combat strength yet. Uh, how many of these have got? 12. <sighs> Here's someone. Okay, that, the fact that there's someone patrolling around here means we really don't want to use explosives to pick this, so I guess we're just going to have to use free picks. Image of Walton Simons and an augmentation canister. Okay, let's have a look and see what this is. You can hear people around. Aqualung environmental resistance. Well, that was a waste of free picks. Thing, mate. Didn't see nothing. Come on. Don't get stuck in the window, Ledge. There we go. Okay, so we can't do anything more about that at the moment until we get the camera. And that's some. Um, Again, we could use two picks, but I prefer this one. It's a recharge box. Nice. See, that's why you should never use those things to fill you right back up to full health unless you know there's not going to be a recharge bot around. Hmm. I honestly don't know what that keypad does. I should know, I'm sure I must have used it sometime, but I can't remember for the life of me. Mm, I'll take the lockpick and I'll take the multi-tool now. Maybe a... Whoa! Bloody cameras. They've seen me. <laughs> I love this game. I sometimes so love this game. Guy comes charging in like he's dirty Harry and I just sneak out the corner behind him. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. I really love doing that. <laughs> now, problem is we got to get all the way through here. And... Again, these guys aren't particular. Whoa. Got no tranquilizer darts. What are we going to do about this, guys? I'm going to have to sneak up behind him or something because I really am completely out of tranks. Now, again, this guy is just a naval base guard. He's just basically following orders and doing his job and, you know. Um, we think some terrible intruders coming in, you know, if you find him shooting him is not particularly, you know, an illegal order or anything. Um, 
So I really don't want to go on a massacre of the whole base if I can avoid it. So, there's only one. Oh no. <sighs> what are we going to do about these guys? And they're all on alert now, so it'll spot me at much greater distances. Shit. Yeah, we're currently loaded with strength darts. If I use fire darts, it'll kill him. So, I can't, he's completely out in the open, easy to snipe, but very hard to sneak up on without all the other dudes seeing. Come on. Come on. It's dented. Hold it. Hail this guy and we all get a bonus. Right. This ain't over. Okay, where's this guy coming from? Not coming from in there. Okay, that's creepy. There's someone here, and I don't know who. Base commander's office. So, as you can see, everyone on this base is carrying explosives. That makes it more dangerous, but it also makes it nice and easy for you to get upgrades for blowing up the ship. Not upgrades, what the heck am I talking about? Explosives. Blah, blah. Cannot talk straight tonight. Now we can try and sneak around there. Let's go hide back in here again until the security alert goes off. I think our best bet for infiltration would be to sneak in through here. But if we don't want this to become a massacre, we have to be very, very careful. See, this has got a lot of obstacles. This and we've got hardly any of this left either. Haven't seen you in a week. Where you been? Ah, workers' camp. Messed up my hand while I was working on the sewer shutoff grate. Damn thing came down and nearly took off my whole arm. You gonna be all right? Yes, okay. They told me they were gonna fix it. Of course, they waited until after I got hurt to do it. I uh, <laughs> saw a bunch of folks working on that shed out back a few days ago. Figured they must be tinkering with the control valve, sure enough. And of course, there's cameras everywhere. We've got no hope of getting through here while those cameras are on. And unlike Denton, um, unlike Adam Jensen in Deus Ex 3, this guy can actually hack while crouching. Progress of technology and all that. But I can hear someone coming. Come on, hurry up. Camera off, door open, camera off, camera off. And let's make a run for it now. Just to make sure everything's nice and <gasps> cool down a bit. And there's a guy through here, but you can't get through here because 
that's an indestructible fence. So, hmm. See, this game is quite tactical in a way. Um, now we could smash that, but we're going to wait until we've neutralised a bit more of security. Because the problem at the moment is that we just have no non-lethal weaponry. But the ca we've switched off the camera in here now. So, we can explore these offices a bit. And there's another security terminal here. And ammo storage warehouse. Nice. It's locked. They're all locked. Lovely. And that door won't close. Must be a locked door. So, let's hack this and see what we can get into with this. I must admit, the hacking mini game was a lot better in Deus Ex 3. Robots in standby mode. You can also reprogram the robots to massacre everyone, but seriously, why? <laughs> Gently, gently. <laughs> Supply closet key added to nano key ring. Key to the commander's office. So does that mean we can get into this one now? No. Okay, we can't sword that one, so let's use one of our precious lockpicks. A pistol, just what I always wanted. And we'll hack the computer. Interesting. Access to the advanced submarine is restricted. All entrances have been sealed and the codes will change daily. Today's code is 99. Nice. And the med kit. Okay, we've now managed to turn a lot of the security off. Everything's going nicely. And just because I'm a tiny bit leery of the fact that the game crashed, I'm going to stop the recording and then just restart it again so I don't lose it and I'll save the game while I'm here. So until then, fellas, have a good one. <laughs>